Let's get to our off the record parting shots. Bob Clay, you're up first. Uh, Sierra Club it went up on the air this uh, week on an uh, ad to you know uh, support President Obama and tell everybody to call their congressman about dirty air or something like that. And this is only the beginning. It's going to go out throughout the whole year, and we're going to have millions upon millions of dollars here in Ohio like that. Yeah. I fearlessly predict that Mitt Romney wins the South Carolina primary on uh, <laughs> Tuesday. He becomes the uh, nominee. I think he's almost impossible to stop. The fat lady may not have sung yet, but she's humming pretty loud. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Daryl. <clears throat> Um, Mike, as I was in New Hampshire this past week, I had to think about the first time I was up there covering a campaign. I was in 84, covering a little bit of, of John Glenn's very short-lived effort, of course. Um, two guys uh, who sort of showed me the ropes, both Ohio journalists, Tom Brzeitis, uh, Brian Usher of the Beacon Journal. Uh, they're both not with us anymore. We lost, uh, we lost Tom several years ago. Uh, Brian, we just lost a, a couple of weeks ago. So just want to tip my hat to them, and I was really remembering them th both this week. Okay. And following up on uh, Daryl's comment here this week brought us Friday the 13th, brought us our first real snow day of the year, so all this bad news. Also uh, a reminder this week that uh, Bill Hershey, who's on this panel quite often, is going into retirement, so to speak, and, and so we're going to miss seeing him around the state house and miss uh, following him during this presidential year and, and having him on the campaign trail with us. But he will still be here on Columbus on the Record. He's going to continue on as our, as our I don't want to say elder, an analyst, but he's going to stay on the show. Nobody ever retires. <laughs> 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 <laughs>